Well, people across the metro did take the warning to stay home seriously. But most went to work anyway on their driveways and their sidewalks. Our Mike McKnight takes us through the neighborhoods of Northwest Omaha and Elkhorn. Even with snow still blowing this morning, homeowners like Todd Fisher fired up their snow blowers. A little heavy, a little, snow, a little wet. That's what homeowners who don't own a snow thrower found out the hard way. Be careful. I know. 66 year old Dave Hillman knows shoveling can be heart stopping. All right, now I'm not too worried. I know you got to worry about it. No, if you got to be careful, I know I'm being careful. You got to rest so much, so. But clearing the driveway doesn't guarantee you can get out of the neighborhood, though in many areas that may have been easier than expected. Many of the main ways in and out of neighborhoods have already been plowed by either private contractors or just people who are good Samaritans helping their neighbors. Jeff Worth plowed the main routes in his own neighborhood before neighbors got out and around to even pay him a thank you. Just to get from here out to our main street so we can get out of the neighborhood. Captain Pat, why do you do it? Just being a good neighbor or yep, what? Just being a good neighbor. The blizzard warning costs many businesses like fast food restaurants a morning's worth of earnings, if not all day. Yeah. But for kids, it's doggone good fun. Playing in the snow and throwing snowballs with the dog. <laughs> <laughs> he likes <to> <laughs> While there's beauty to be found in a snowstorm, the cleanup afterward leaves some alone with a shovel and their thoughts. This spot takes everything out of me I've got. I keep thinking Arizona, Arizona. In Nebraska, you just have to keep plowing through winter. In the Elkhorn area, Mike McKnight, WWT6 News.